Hi guys, we're back again. Well, good morning. This weekend we are staying at Beaver's Bend State Park again, but this time we are staying in the Acorn Loop. Last time we were in Armadillo, and this time we're trying out a different loop, and Marty is just really not having it. I think today we're just gonna kinda take it easy. There was a playground right up the road a little bit in the loop. Probably gonna do a lot of fishing today. There's a lot of really great hiking trails and paths around here, and I think I saw one of the trailheads near our loop, so that's kind of exciting. And uh, yeah, we're just kind of hanging out today. So welcome to our trip at Beaver's Bend State Park Acorn Loop. Ooh, I know, scare me. Ah! Yes. The loop has that way, and the web has that way. No. So which way do we go? We just go straight down. Okay. If we get lost, it's on Blake. We got half a bottle of Gatorade. morning we have been up since 5 30 this morning because um this little guy over here decided to wake up and not only does he decide to wake up but he wakes up and wakes everybody else up so then she got up then the dog got up then i got up so it's going to be a long day today um we're all going to be very tired i'm sure but our plans today are to go for a hike and then come back and eat some lunch and kind of just explore and spend the rest of the day kind of in the campground. Um, Beaver's Bend is huge. It is a huge state park. There's lots of different like campgrounds or loops. Um, this one that we are in has zero cell service entirely. So that's kind of a nice to have a little bit of a break from like checking our phones and getting alerts and things. Um, so I'm literally just using it as a camera and a clock, which is kind of nice. Um, the kids are exploring. Ellie is, Ellie, what are you doing? I'm, I'm, giving, I'm giving the plants some yummy food. She's giving the plants some yummy food. Um, the boys are working on, here, I'll show you. Adult toys. A, well, don't say adult toys. <laughs> That's a little different meaning. Uh, they are working on the RC car. Some yummy, sweet, yummy, um, treat food. Okay, I love that. Yep, as usual, it always breaks. 
Every single time we use it. Every single time they use it. Don't need to replace parts, just adjust it. <laughs> so they are fixing that for the 40 millionth time. And we're just kind of hanging out. So we will see you guys when we go on our hike later. Bye. Oh, she's done with you. Bye. Bye. What do you see? Pebbles, where's they? How can you tell? Because they're, um, I've seen tadpoles a lot. You need some help? Oh, lots of spider bugs. I mean, water bugs. Water bugs? Yeah, water. I mean, spider water bugs. What are you doing? I'm trying to call the oh, deer right there. Nice job, Ellie. This is where the people that the state park is named after, this is part of where they used to live. And the guy that the state park was named after, he died in 1936 and his wife died in 1955 and that's when the state park was starting to be built. Yeah. What's, what's happening Wait, here? Wait, like, like right here. So, um... <laughs> Okay, Ellie, get inside. Show them how it's done. Get in there like a no. tree troll. No. Okay, fine. I'll get in. Spiders, it's no fault. I don't know if I'm going to fit in here. <laughs> You're barely fitting. Okay. Am I going on there? Mm-hmm. Well, what was your favorite part of the weekend? Probably our hikes. Yeah. We did one hike that was, how long was the first one supposed to be? 0.75 miles? Yeah. It felt much longer than that. <laughs> uh, I feel like people weren't really using that one, so it was very overgrown. I walked into a few spider webs with spiders in them. We did a mile hike, uh, which you guys saw footage of, and that one was fun. Um, it was the the hike like the trail was much more used so it was like flat and there wasn't a bunch of shrubs everywhere and it was more hike friendly <laughs> the trick is to go early yeah, by the time we left there was a lot of people on the trail a lot it was getting so busy yeah. and i was just like no no thank you but it's broken bow on labor day weekend that's true. Yeah, if you're coming to Broken Bow on Labor Day weekend, scratch that. If you're coming to any state park on Labor Day weekend, just be prepared that you're going to run into a lot of people and a lot of day users and any holiday weekend. Any holiday weekend. Um, but it's such a big park, like it seemed to be. Oh yeah, the park is huge. Yeah. So 
It seemed you, to be You fine. definitely find your own space. Yeah. So it was fun. We will definitely be back at Beaver's Bend. So the last time we came here, we stayed in the Armadillo Loop and it was, it was rough. It was a beautiful loop with really sweet families, but maneuvering in and out of those loops. Um, so I'll actually link the last video I had where we went to Beaver's Bend, where we saw at least three campers near total themselves, just from trying to maneuver like around trees. So we, I was very nervous to come back to Beaver's Bend because I thought, oh my gosh, it's gonna be so hard to get the trailer in. And Armadillo Loop has been awesome. This is not Armadillo. Shoot. This is Acorn. Acorn. <laughs> Armadillo was rough, Acorn is awesome. Um, anyway, so we'll show you guys some of the packing up tomorrow and then back home we go. All right, see you guys next time.